We were training in Kenya, and we were called for a mission. Just another day, just another job. And then it happened. It's a really inspiring piece, I think. Um, you do a great job humanizing both of them in their story and making it something, um, although not very relatable to the masses, there's a lot of uh, really memorable moments in there and uh, really poignant dialogue that a lot of people can attach to. Um, I think it has a great 80s style uh, freeze frame, uh, you know, image and where they are in their story at the end. I think that's always really fun. That's one of my favorite kinds of uh, buttons to a piece. I loved how this film took so many different types of filmmaking techniques. There's the point of view shot, the voiceover where there's not really a lot of dialogue. We're really doing a lot in voiceover. There was a sl slight moments of animation of just still objects. It's all very different ways to tell a story and usually filmmakers usually rely on one or two methods and this filmmaker relied on about five different methods which made the film very intriguing to watch because at the beginning you don't really know what's going on you know the guy got in an accident but you're not really sure what's going on um and if they quickly through the alter the, through all the different types of filmmaking techniques they really get into this to show what's going on that he's not letting something stop him he's finding his strength these are great filmmaking techniques and the story itself is quite powerful that there's very little dialogue is all just mainly voiceover and it's like a grandpa telling a story it feels very familiar the cinematography that takes place here you know makes it feel like it's more of a reenactment documentary and you see these instances occur of you know accidents happen and sometimes it debilitates you yet you still have to rise back up and adapt to your situations of what's to come and that's sort of what we see experienced here and you see that this um is a a situation where this character has lost the ability uh, to function as they're humanly used to, and they have to not only find their new normal, but also find the thing that gives them light again. And so we get to see that through these act of sports and playing this form of um you know, athletic uh, hobbies, so to speak. And so we really get to see them um, persevere despite uh, the challenges that have hindered them once before. And so the cinematography is really what uh, makes this a stark uh, contrast and difference in the way that we're used to kind of seeing these stories being told. I like the originality of the close-ups and the slow motion shots as well. The use of light and contrast to tell us this magnificent story of perseverance through friendship and strength. Inner strength and bodily strength, it's just the will to live, the will to succeed, the will to exceed. It was beautifully um, told and they also have this inspiring music score and also learning at the end about the film film crew stories of overcoming their own disabilities and hurdles. It was just unbelievable. It felt like a really cinematic, high quality, super polished biopic, uh, really well written, great performances, fantastic cinematography. Um, all those parts just come together and make this just really a masterfully done uh, piece. It was just interesting, um, really, really takes you into that world, gets you invested. Um, yeah, really striking work. There's just so much thoughtfulness to all the shots, like even the the, the coloring uh, from one sort of uh, vignette to the other. Um, the um, the 
the variety of shots using silhouettes. Like it's just really, really uh, thoughtfully done uh, and crafted, I should say. Um, and it starts with a, an already like uh, compelling subject matter and it gets you into it right away. Immensely creative in exploring the aftermath of a physical injury that changes how you live a civilian life um, after a time of service. And I think it, it does a really great job of showing both the difficulties and following a hero's journey path where we see the character grow through these challenges and meet them and adapt in a really inspiring and motivating way. I love this true story of two military men who conquer all odds and who end up supporting and encouraging each other. I love their strong relationship of love, respect, and even humor awesome soundtrack of popular motivational songs and upbeat instrumentals, clever editing, notably of the two men, one in the water and one with a punching bag, very dramatic scenes, excellent dialogue of banter and challenge between them. I enjoyed reading all the bios at the end. So many inspiring people working hard despite their various disabilities. 